Hey Calvary Plymouth. Hi. Welcome to today's Devo, Psalm 119, the longest chapter in the Bible. Now, don't let that scare you. If you sit down and read it, it might take you about four and a half minutes to read through the whole thing. But we want to focus on one verse specifically, and that's Psalm 105, which says, Your word is a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path. Now, we might just kind of read over that and think that sounds real pretty, but have you ever been out at nighttime, pitch black, no lights around, and you've got one little lamp, you've got a torch, and you can see just about as far as the next step that you take. And the kind of the principle here is that God, we need his word to take every step in our lives. He loves us so much that he is concerned and wants to direct every step that we take. In fact, the importance here we see on God's word throughout this chapter is amazing. I did just a quick word count. There are about seven different words that are used to refer to God's word. They are, first of all, word. Then we have ordinances, precepts, commandments, statutes, law, and testimonies. And if I added those up, again, just a quick count, I came up with over 168 times in 176 verses that this chapter is referring to God's word. So I think it really shows how important it is. And there's a couple of other verses here in verse 50. It says, this is my comfort in my affliction for your word has given me life. Again, in verse 93, I will never forget your precepts for by them you have given me life. We also know from reading in Hebrews that it says the word of God is living and powerful. And God's word does, it brings life to us. Listen, there's a lot of great books to read to help you in life, but the most important one is the Word of God, and you need to spend time in it. So we pray today that if you're not, that you would, and that if you're struggling in your walk, that you would spend time in God's Word, find out what He has to say about your circumstances, and let Him lead and guide and direct you. So Father, we lift we lift anyone up that is in that, uh, in that position right now, that they're just struggling with what to do. Lord, your Word is very clear. Your Word is life. And Lord, we need to use it in every step that we take. So Father, we pray that you would bless the reading of your word. Anyone that's out there reading, studying, Lord, speak to their hearts, Lord. And we love you and we thank you. We thank you that your word is life. So Lord, bless it. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. All right, God bless you guys. See you tomorrow. Bye.